So today I'm going to show you how to fold um, jeans perfectly and Marie kondo -ed. I'm going to go ahead and fold it exactly how she does it in the book and then the second way I'm going to show you some tips to make it a little more uniform. So this is how she does it. So she takes her jeans and folds it exactly in half with the pockets facing out. And then she just straightens it out, smooths it out, and then she takes the crotch, tucks it in, so you have a long rectangle, and then you fold it almost to the very top. Uh, it could be like about the seam right here, right where the belt loop is. So you slide that. So there's the belt loop. And then she folds it in thirds. So one, two. And then she stands it upright. So that's the Marie Kondo fold. Next, I'll show you how to make it a little more uniform. Um, on my channel, there's a lot of videos how to fold jeans. I used to work retail, so I have a lot of variations of jean folds. So I have my method. I'm just a little more used to it, just because I've done it so, for so long. But So you're going to take your jean. Fold it so the pockets are inside. So we have a flat base. Smooth that out. Go ahead and do the same thing. Tuck the crotch in. And then fold almost to the very top, just where the belt loop is. And then go ahead and fold them to thirds, just like how she does it. So there we have it. And it will stand up. Like so. Um, the, it's a sm slight change, but instead of seeing the pockets, now this is the surf area, surface area you're going to be looking at when you're looking through the jeans. It's a little cleaner looking. And then besides that, when you pull it out, you can see the brand and the type of fit right here, so you don't have to unravel it or anything like that. So, um, once you fold this to make more uniform folds throughout all your jeans, you're going to measure this length right here. And I found out it's about the same as this piece of paper. So we're going to do that to every single pair of jeans just to ensure that every jean will look exactly the same. So I'm going to put this aside and uh, I will go ahead and use this pair of jeans. Let me just demonstrate one more time. So here's the jean. And we'll fold the crotch in. Fold it all the way up. Um, just where the belt loop starts. Right there, fold it. And then go ahead and take your piece of paper. And then fold it right here. So use that piece of paper as a guide. To so then you can perfectly see that this is the same size as the other one. And fold it up. And then stand it up. Um, so this pair and this pair are exactly the same. So when we store it, so pretend this is my dresser right here. It's just an H&M uh, box. My clothes came in this, and I sometimes use it to store my jeans as well, just because I have so many of them. And just go ahead and put it in like this. So when I fill it all the way up, this is what I'm going to be seeing. The seams, they're going to be all be even and the same. So if you can see this as like a rectangle, they're all very uniform, same size. I have uh, them all folded, but once I do, I'll take a picture and then insert that in. This will ensure uniform folds. So hopefully you found this video helpful. Hit the like button and subscribe for more.